Welcome back ladies and gents. What brings you to this video is the beautiful mathematical statement 0 factorial is equal to 1. What a beauty! To show that 0 factorial is equal to 1, there are many different methods that we can approach. The easiest method is to spot a pattern by taking the factorial of standard numbers. I'm going to start off with 6 factorial. 6 factorial by definition is 6 multiplied by 5, by 4, by 3, by 2, by 1. I'm going to use this statement to write 5 factorial in a more compact form. We know that 5 factorial by definition is 5 multiplied by 4, by 3, by 2, by 1. However, we can write it in a more compact form and that is 6 factorial over 6. If I go back to my previous statement, I can divide both sides by 6 to give me 6 factorial over 6 is equal to 6 multiplied by 5 by 4 by 3 by 2 by 1 over 6. The 6 in the numerator cancels the 6 in the denominator to give me 5 multiplied by 4 by 3 by 2 by 1 which is precisely 5 factorial. Hence 5 factorial can be written as 6 factorial over 6 which is equivalent to 720 over 6. This is equal to 120. In the same way, 4 factorial is given by 5 factorial over 5. This is equivalent to 120 over 5, which is equal to 24. 3 factorial is given by 4 factorial over 4. This is equivalent to 24 over 4, which is equal to 6. 2 factorial is given by 3 factorial over 3, which is equivalent to 6 over 3. This is equal to 2. 1 factorial is given by 2 factorial over 2, which is equivalent to 2 over 2. This is equal to 1. Now we go on to the beauty, 0 factorial. This is given by 1 factorial over 1, which is equal to 1 over 1, and this is equal to 1. Hence, 0 factorial is equal to 1. If you found this video useful, please don't forget to tap the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell to receive regular updates on Juicy Maths content.